सूरचंद्राय राधी कावईष्टालय कृष्णाय कृष्ण भक्ताय तद्भक्ताय नमो नम बद्धे बितनुते भक्ति मूर्ख मावर्त श्रुति यत्पाह वंदे श्री मदन गोपाल प्रभु जैनिताई हाउ आर यू माई डेट जुबोटीज होप ऑल ऑफ यू आर वेल अगेन वी आर इन गौर गोविंद कथा श्री श्री चैतन्य चरितामृत कथा श्री कृष्ण चैतन्य महाप्रभु नाउ ही इज शेयरिंग हिज फीलिंग्स हिज रियलाइजेशन टू ऑल कलेजीवर्स थ्रू रामानंद रॉय दैट इज वॉट एग्जैक्टली ही वॉन्टेड टू गिव अस दैट इज वाई फॉर वट ही अपियर्ड हिस अवतार चारी प्रेमेर भक्ति दिया नचाई मुखबौन नाउ आई स्प्रेड एवरीवेयर ऑल ओवर दिस प्लैनेटरी सिस्टम द मोस्ट हाइस्ट four kinds of very pure prem of braja exactly that is what he is doing through ramananda rai it was never before it was never described in that way how ramananda roy is describing and mahaprabhu wanted to open this secret most confidential it was before most confidential but now he is opening to everyone not judging anyone it's like rain so what we should do for that from that for this prema we have to open our heart and it is not easy to open heart that lock which is there for our heart it's difficult to open and to open that heart the key is bhakti practice only by bhakti practice one can open that lock then it will open the door of our heart
so the practice was before practice was before and not only that it is not enough only to open the eyes to open our heart we have to put it in favorable way how it can enter there i said now mahaprabhu's mercy is falling down like rain so if i put two pot in the rain and after some time i found one was full of water but one was empty then i found my mistake what is that 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 empty pot i put there upside down if the pot is upside down then how the rain will go inside that pot another one was okay upside up so not only enough to open our heart we have to put it in the rain and in that way upside up not upside down that it can enter inside of our heart now ramananda rai is describing about most highest part and that is about radha prema भक्त मुखे भक्ति कथा अतीब रसाल भक्ति कथा इट स्वीट स्वीटर देन एनीथिंग बट दैट भक्ति कथा विल बी नेक्टर यन स्वीट व्हेन वन वेरी प्योर रसिक डिवोटी well explain describe that time it will be sweet like nectar then it is not only sweet it's nectar and swam bhagwan he loves to hear that from rashika devotee and there is no doubt ramananda rai is a rashik intelligent scholar very pure devotee so it must be sweeter than anything like nectar Sri Krishna Sri Krishna Chaitanya Prabhu he wanted to drink that nectar more and more and more that's why again and again he was asking so many question to rai that he wanted to push ramananda rai to go more deep and ramananda rai she was following his desire 
because for intelligent indication is enough don't need to say anything clearly with intelligent for them indication is enough so ramananda rai is intelligent chatura clever so he got it inside of his heart what exactly sri krishna chaitanya mahaprabhu wanted so he start to describe in that way just following his sir sri krishna chaitanya prabhu sir he was following his desire he was following his indication so when sri krishna chaitanya mahaprabhu he arise one question some doubts about the love of shrimati radharani how ramananda roy can accept it so he start to probe it no the question was from sri krishna chaitanya prabhu or oh, rai isn't it that sri krishna is following the sadhana of his devotees because he clearly said je jathamang prapadyante tang stathe yo bhajami ham yes it's right it's true prabhu then how it happened that he was afraid in rast leela so that he has to he had to steal shrimati radharani from that place and run to another place why krishna did this if he was, he was afraid if it is then rai i have to say maybe shrimati radharani's prem love was not special it was also like other brej gopis that is why krishna maybe he has some love special love for shrimati radharani and he want to he wanted to spend more time with shrimati radharani but because of her love it was not so special so krishna was afraid if he will do this in front of other brej gopis so they will be angry they will not accept it from open heart right maybe that is why krishna did this and it was not acceptable for ramananda rai he said no prabhu okay there is proof and he start to describe vasanta rasa and same thing it was happened there prabhu you know what is happening everything the lilas it is by the desire of yoga maya and it was the instruction of krishna bhagavan that he said you can do whatever you want but lila must be 
very beautiful and for lila you can control our mind also bhagwan give her free hand to do anything আমিও না জানি তাহা না জানে গোপি জনে যোগ মায়া করিবেন আপনার মন কিন্তু শ্রী চৈতন্য চরিত অমৃতা ইট ইস সাইড আমিও না জানি তাহা ভগবান ইস সাইড দ্যাট what is happening what is going how it is going i don't know anything not even the braj gopis what is happening what is going everything it is happening by yoga maya so prabhu in rash lila also something happened and in vasanta rash lila also because when and that is the very beautiful nature of krishna that krishna want to satisfy everyone if you love krishna so how you love krishna krishna will do the same in ras lila all the braj gopis they were invited by krishna because of their love because of their tapasya brata and they had that great love for krishna so they were there first krishna decorated everyone and it happened by himself krishna he decorated all the braj gopis because it was before not really very good decoration of them and then he started ras lila the dancing and he wanted to dance with everyone so ta sang madhe dayo dayo with every gopi there was one krishna with samata radharani also one krishna was there rai shri chaitanya prabhu ask rai before you said this ras lila there is no aisharya i know krishna love to use his aisharya krishna love to show his aisharya but you said that krishna rejected his own aisharya here in braj and aisharya it cannot manifest in front of braj gopis because they are very powerful by their love but now you are saying with every gopi with each gopi there is one krishna is it not aisharya isn't it aisharya rai so how he can manifest how he can use his aisharya here because all the braj gopis they are very powerful by their prema how aisharya came here appear here
when Aishwarya was rejected Prabhu who is very dedicated servant who is very dedicated lover or beloved maybe somehow when they will be rejected by their master maybe he rejected but they will not go away because of their love because of their attachment so aishwarya maybe he was rejected here in braj by krishna but he was not disappeared from that place he was always there he's like that very dedicated very old servant anyhow any way he want to serve his prabhu so here krishna wanted to satisfy all the braj gopis because they love they perform that brata not only that because of krishna they came here at the midnight after leaving everything with great sankalpa they said poti shutanayo bhratri bandhavan oti bilangho tyant chutagata they clearly said it that we came here in that way we left everything in that way that in our heart from our heart we took that vow that will never accept them how krishna can ignore that love he wanted to satisfy so that's why krishna did not know it was his de- desire to satisfy everyone but without his aisharya he cannot so that is why by his knowledge without his knowledge without knowledge of krishna by yoga mai aisharya served krishna so millions of krishna different for manifested there krishna did not know that krishna wanted to satisfy everyone but the aisharya it manifest by itself prabhu you can say it, it was the desire of my yoga maya so that is why with everyone one krishna was there it was without any knowledge of krishna it's happened and same thing happened here in vasanta rasa in vasanta rasa same thing happened here sri krishna was dancing with all braj gopi and one form also was there with shrimati radharani everyone was enjoying and everyone was thinking in that way that krishna is only with me because they were inside of their heart with krishna they are not looking to each other but somehow 
So Radha Rani's face and eyes were turned from Krishna. She looked at one Braj Gopi and she found Krishna is dancing with her. So she was surprised. Oh, Krishna was with me. I just turned my face and he ran to that Gopi. And again, she turned her face to another Gopi, another one. Again, she found another one Krishna is there. In that way, three, four, five, Braj Gopi. Oh, Krishna, you are running one to other. From me to that Braj Gopi, then from her to the her, from her to her. Oh, Krishna, how you can do that? Is it not love? How you can do that? You are running from one to another one. So you, your nature is like that honeybees. How they are flying from one flower to another flower to collect the honey. So you are nature also like same. Like Bambel be like honey be. Brahmar Shabhav Krishna. So that means no one is special for you. Not me, not anyone of them. Everyone in front of you are same. Krishna, it's not love. So if I'm not special for you, so it's good to go away from this place. So Srimati Radharani still left that place. Exactly it was happened in that way. It was not the desire of Krishna that she will dance with everyone. It's happened without his knowledge. His Aisharya served him by the desire of my yoga maya. That is why Prabhu. So Srimati Radharani she just left that place and when Krishna realized that she is angry without saying anything to other Braj Gopis Prabhu this time in Vasanta Raslila Krishna was not stealing Srimati Radharani he didn't hide anything from others. When he found Srimati Radharani is not, was not there, so he just stopped dancing and he just go for searching Srimati Radharani. Prabhu? Krishna? Here, she was following the special love of Srimati Radharani. Isn't it? Again, Sri Krishna Chaitanya Prabhu, he asked, But Rai, why Srimati Radharani was angry? Because you said, they have no self-desire. 
देहब समर्थारति कंचेद विशेष मायांता शंभो गच्छा जया भित रत्या तादात ममा पन्या सा समर्थे तिभन्यते You said, you described the truth of Samartharati and you said only the Braj Gopis. They have such kinds of very special love. That's why he, you use this word Kanchi. Very, very rare. It's only in the heart of Brajagopis. Why it is very special? Because Sambhagacha Jaya Pita Ratya Tadat Mama Paniya Sashamathet Vanyate They have no self-desire for their self-satisfaction. They have no self-desire for their self-pleasure. Their happiness, their bliss, their pleasure, everything is connected with Krishna. If Krishna is happy, they are happy. If Krishna is pleased, they are also pleased. If Krishna is distressed, they have the pain. Then why Sramati Radharani was angry? Because in their heart, everything with Krishna's pleasure. So if Srimati Radharani found that Krishna is happy with them. That is normal for them. They must be happy. But it was not like that. You said Srimati Radharani was angry. Why? Ramananda Rai said, Prabhu. Actually, it is the nature of love. Aheri bhagati premna shabhava kutila bhavet. You know, the nature of love is like snake, crooked, kutil. Like snake. and the nature of love also like snake. Why it's compared with snake? Only for this crooked movement? No. Because they have venom and in love also there is venom but the difference also there the venom of love it's not killing It's burning, burning the heart. And always it is work. So the nature of Brajagopi's love also like this. So in the heart of Srimati Radharani, Bhamya Bhav, 
you know prabhu the females they have very special mood it is not like male the girls the women they have very special mood ato hetar hetascha yunarman udanchati and that very special mood is appearing most the time in love nothing they will accept very easily and it is not fault it's the nature of love bamya bhava very special mood and it's coming it's manifesting only in the heart of girls females so it's happened with simati radharani they have no self desire simati radharani also not any self desire sometimes she is arranging the meeting she is asking to her manjaris go to krishna and satisfy him manjaris they always denying this but srimati radharan sometimes challenging it's also happened before before rashtri la also in avishara that krishna promised to come to her but he went in another place so it was not really new srimati radharan knew everything about his nature about his mood and about this also that only she can please krishna she is also know this that krishna wherever he will go he will come back to her she know everything <coughs> she know everything then also it's happened because it's very special nature of love so she just left that place and krishna went to search her because this is rasa leela and it is said rasa leela is samak shara vasana Rash Lila is the crown jewel of all his pastimes all his lila So in this lila everyone will join everyone must be very very special Everyone must be very pure by their mind and heart and krishna wanted to make them very pure and qualified for rashtrila but then also actually you know prabhu everything it was happening by mother yoga maya ma yoga maya because if there is no variation in love loving relation if it is only straight line then it is not very pleasurable it 
it must be up and down then again little bit up again down then more up then down then it will be very beautiful viprolambho man pravas all these situation stages are coming to develop the pleasure to increase the pleasure of their meeting and yoga maya always try to do it do that always trying to make their meeting most highest so that's why everything it was happening so krishna he just run he left that place from in front of all braj gopis and he start to search srimati radharani after all the forest he went to that very confidential kunja which is just next to river yamuna krishna was very sure that srimati radharani must be there when he he was there he found there is also no radharani then he lost everything all his energy anangavana anang khinna manasha it was not material last prabhu because their karma is not like material last material karma their karma also is very special what is the speciality of their love what is their meeting sambhoga in samarthaarathi it is said sambhogacha jaya bhita so what is their sambhoga with krishna what is krishna sambhoga with them because they have no self desire they don't want anything from krishna they have no self pleasure so and krishna his atmaram he is not dependent to entertain himself for anything he is not dependent with his associates he is not dependent for any other incidents or place or anything his atma raman he is free from everything no desire in his heart then why it was happening why shrimati radharani he was she was angry and here ananga khinna manasha sukadev goswami is saying that now krishna is really weak by karma what is their karma if it is like material world the boat is tomorrow we'll continue this katha today i'm a little bit busy so today i have to finish now i have one meeting very uh, special meeting and i have to go there now right now so my dear devotees gaur gobind katha rai ramanand sangbad katha is taking rest for today 
tomorrow again we'll meet at 3 p.m. So for today, Jainitai, Haribol.